Hello everyone. So today I wanted to show you a new solar panel that I picked up yesterday. It's not actually a new solar panel, it's new to me. But uh, the person I bought it from said he never used it. And it's an 18 foot long flexible solar panel. And it's made by this company, Unisolar, who is not in business anymore. Went out of business a few years ago. Uh, did a little research on it. The panel itself, this one is 136 watts. And there is 22 of these little individual panels here. Now, some people have successfully cut these and made a smaller panel. I don't really intend to do that, but I just want to show you how flexible. Now, it's, it's winter time, about 20 degrees outside, but this thing is very flexible and it can be uh, rolled up. And I want to say it felt like, I don't know, 10 to 15 pounds to me when I rolled it up. But uh, now this outputs, I think the open voltage is around 46. When I had my voltmeter on, it was between 46 and 48. And if you can see, it, it is a winter day, and I'm trying to get the sun. It's not very sunny out today at all. It's kind of overcast, but the sun is peeking through. Now I do have it hooked up to an MPPT charge controller, and the one I'm using is a Blue Sky 3024i. And so what you can see here is the voltage at the battery or at the controller is 27.9 and there's one amp coming in right now. So when the sun was shining a little bit earlier, I was getting about 1.8 amps, you know, somewhere in the neighborhood of 40 and 50 volts, I think is what I was getting. Uh, again, I don't have them angled at all. I just have them laying right out here. So it's not a, a great test. But, uh, you know, just the way it is, I was putting around 50 volts, I'm sorry, 50 watts into the uh, batteries. So these are the same batteries you've seen on some of my other uh, videos. They're Trojan L16ACs, and they're 6 volts each, and I have them in series to work on 24 volts. So uh, it's just a very temporary situation. I just wanted to see, I got these panels yesterday, I wanted to see how well it would perform. And the batteries were at around 90%, give or take, uh, before I even started. So it's not a great test really to see how well this panel operates, you know, with the sun conditions. Uh, like I said, it's kind of uh, overcast so I'm not getting great great sun but for the conditions I'm putting out 40 to 50 watts I can't complain uh, so you know my my purpose for these really were to put them on my shed and then just keep my batteries that are for my tractors uh, just keep them topped off uh, that's what I intend to use it for and I also can you know, try to top off these batteries as well. The good news is, is like I said, the open voltage was 46, and uh, I think the the usable voltage it was somewhere around the 30 to 33 mark. Uh, so they should be high enough to even go into. Uh, when my panel goes into absorption mode or even. Uh, well, I guess it would be absorption mode. It's, geez, I want to say these are something like 29 volts. So, the solar panel should be able to get up to 29 volts based off of what I've seen. But I will keep my eye out on it. Okay, anyway, just wanted to give a quick video of the new solar panel I got. 